Hi and welcome along to a second video on how to draw a ray diagram uh, for an astronomical telescope. There was nothing wrong with the previous one, I just think there's a few techniques that weren't mentioned, um, so I've done this one as well. Uh, just a reminder, this is the optical axis. Um, this is the objective lens. That's the one facing the stars, so the stars are out here. This is the eyepiece lens. So our eye is going to go here. I'll put that in at the end. Um, this is the principal focus for both lens. So this distance here is FO, the focal length of the objective lens, which I've set to be 10 centimetres using the ruler. And this is 2.5 centimetres, um, the principal to the, the focal length of the eyepiece lens. Um, what I haven't done this time is put a principal focus to the left of the objective. Often there isn't space to do that, and that's probably what this video is about, really. So ever, as ever, we start by drawing our easiest ray. I'm just going to swap colour to make it really clear what's a ray and what's not a ray. So we have a ray come through the principal focus, so through the centre of the lens. It carries on a straight line because all rays that go through the centre of the lens carry on as a straight line. Um, what does it do next? Well, what we have to imagine is, we have to imagine this point here, which is in line with the principal focus. So that's where all the rays that come, all parallel rays coming through the objective lens um, will go will go through um, that point. So this ray on that side, so that ray has to be parallel to that ray, um, has to cross this ray here. And there we go. Here's another ray. So those three rays, what are they going to do next? Well, they've uh, crossed, actually I haven't drawn mine quite perfectly, they should cross really in line, exactly on that line. These three rays are now going to um, emerge parallel because they've come from in line with that principal focus, but where are they going to go? So we're going to draw this thing called a construction ray. Okay, From here, which is where they should have crossed, we draw a dotted line and we say that if some light had been traveling from there, it would have traveled through the center and gone through the center of the lens. It would have carried on in a straight line. And because all rays coming from that will, line will be parallel, all three of my rays I've drawn in will emerge parallel to that construction ray. And what we can see is that this angle here is smaller than this angle here because the angle of the magnification is how many times bigger that angle is than that angle. So the magnification equals alpha over theta, which is the same as FO, the focal length of the objective, over the focal length of the eyepiece, which in this case is 10 over 2.5, which should give a magnification of times 4. And the final thing to do, it's not actually in the spec, but it's so satisfying. Let's just draw in the eye, which will be collecting the rays. Okay, thank you.